I always wanted to be a mom, and I knew I wanted two boys. We had Blake that morning, everything was great, he was doing great, and then that evening, we met a new doctor, and she said, we think he might have Down syndrome. We had all these people telling us all the things he can't do, right. won't be able to do, limitations on him already before yeah. he even had a chance. I think that was hard for Mitchell. He real protective of Blake. People just assume there's so much he can't do, but people with Down syndrome can really do anything. So we went through the normal milestones, but as, as the boys grew up, Blake always wanted to be like his big brother. We would start getting ready for work, or Mitchell was going to work, and he'd start saying, what about me? So and we found a local uh, barbecue restaurant, and he worked there for over a year, and he, be he became family to them. So that was our plan. He was a senior, he was working at the barbecue restaurant. This is what's gonna happen forever, because it was perfect. And then they called me. They were gonna close. So Saturday morning, Blake gets up and he starts getting ready for work, and I had to tell him, Bubba, they closed the restaurant. There goes our plan. W what the heck are we gonna do? Blake was left without a job, just like a lot of people. So we sort of took the summer off, thought about it, tried to come up with something, and one day around the table, we came up with Blake's snow shack. We just went and bought the trailer. We didn't know where we was going to put it or what was going to happen yet. We researched on the internet and around, talked to different people, got the machine, got the flavors. It just took off from there and just hasn't stopped. The North Texas food truck is gaining international attention. That's Blake Pyron. Blake He's the Pyron. owner of Blake Blake's Pyron snow owns Blake's, Blake's Snow Shack and is the state's youngest business owner living with Down syndrome. He's been able to do something that some Fortune 500 companies only dream of, and that's land a coveted endorsement deal with a NASCAR racing team. And boogity, boogity, boogity. Let's go racing, boys! We've had people come from all over. They've drove three and four hours, five hours, just to come get snow combs. What we thought would be fun for Blake and a job for him turned into encouragement. I remember just holding him, and I promised him, I said, I will never keep you from the world. 